Alright guys, welcome back to another Steam free-to-play walkthrough. Today we have Agents of Chaos. This is a top-down uh, wave type game. We're gonna do the campaign and I'll see how far I can get on endless mode. As always, I'll leave a link to the game in the description if you want to try it for yourself. If you like the video, please like and subscribe. It helps the channel grow and I always appreciate it. Oh, am I the Agent of Chaos? The heroes are breaching the sewers. What is going on here? Oh, this is hard to control. So I go wherever I click to, right? I guess. I guess. I don't know, dude. So I'm the bad guy. That's weird. Why am I the bad guy? Oh, so you don't have to click if you left click. So you can left click to where you're trying to go. How do I change my text? Did I pick up something that changed my text, maybe? I don't know how this keeps changing. I know this ain't good, though. They're chasing me, bro. Get away from me, dogs. How do I change my attack back? Shoot him. Oh, there we go. Oh, so it changes every so often. Okay, I got you. Nice. Okay, we killed wave two. Well, this is interesting. So my attack pattern changes when this purple bar goes out, I guess. You can either click where you want to go, or you can just like... I don't know how to... Okay. So he always shoots in a certain direction, so if I back up... I guess. Oh, never mind. Wait, I'm confused. Ah, okay. So if you click with your left click, it makes it where he keeps shooting the way he's facing. Or you can left click again to make it shoot where the mouse is. So this is the right way I want to shoot when my fireball comes up, pretty much. There we go. I'm learning. I am learning. Nice. Okay, I'm taking damage, but this is... This is a pretty neat concept, actually. I think this is quite... I wish there was a little bit more attacks and stuff, but this is interesting as heck. Okay, I can get out of here now, actually. Yeah, when you're lightning, you can kind of hit him while you're running. You can do it with fire as well, but you gotta have him facing the right way. And then lock it. So, if I wanted to... I, oh, well, that messed up, but this could work. There we go. Fire seems to do a lot more damage than lightning, from my experience. But it's probably because I'm messing with the lightning. Uh, damn, there's a lot of archers this time, boy. Ow. It's a little bit hard to control, but it's all about the movement, I guess. A little bit difficult. Being prepared for chaos. I thought I was the chaos. I'm gonna sit over here and I'm gonna point my fire this way and then do this. Oh, or and miss. That's pretty good. Okay, they don't die in one hit, so you gotta kinda Okay. Interesting. I'm learning, kinda. I am very bad at this game. Lightning just seems a whole lot easier to use than the fire does. To be honest with you. Because the fire only goes in front of you. It's kind of hard to get him shooting the right way with the fire. You kind of have to like do a circle motion to get him like aligned. Pretty difficult, but... I think I'm getting the hang of it though. Lightning, it just goes all the way around you, so I don't really aim it too much. It just kind of happens. Eh, they hit me. Nice. Sick. I sense arcane coming. Yeah, I didn't expect to be the bad guy. I guess it's cool being the bad guy. It's different. Kind of like playing Overlord, I guess. Overlord, he's a bad guy, right? Maybe. That dude's magic missile over there. I take that magic missile punk. Lightning's so good because it just chains everywhere and it's easy to hit. It's really nice all the way around. I don't know. Well, I'm not really seeing anything in this game that could kill me so far if I'm not playing like a dingus. Like, now that I know what I'm doing, it'd be really hard for something to kill me. A powerful buff has appeared at the front entrance. Where's the front entrance at? Like, I know where this map is. That is not the front entrance, apparently. Somebody's shooting green stuff at me. How am I supposed to know where the front entrance is, though? Oh, is he the hero? That mage? Right, I'm still looking for the front entrance, dude. Is this it? 
I guess you get a multiplier up here to your score if you do well, I guess. Interesting. Is this the front entrance? No. You have mages. Tricks are for kids. <laughs> He's so bad at aiming, dude. He's so bad. Oh, now you're doomed for real. I, I know how to aim this one. Ooh, I fell into the thing. Ooh, he's trying to kill me. Never mind, I'm bad. I'm just kidding, bro. Keep getting stuck. Bad spot. Yeah, so you left click to get it where your camera can move, where, or your guy can move, rotate, and then left click again when you get the spot you want. Easy. Easy. A very strong Arkham presence in this wave. I wonder how many waves there are per level. This could be really long. There's like three stages. <laughs> I hit him from downtown, boy. What's up? Music's not bad. It's going... I mean, it's only one jam, but it's not It's not annoying. So that's good. They didn't pick, like, one soundtrack that's, like, good the first time you hear it, and then it's, like, freaking toxic the rest of the time. I don't think there's achievements in this game yet, but this would be a really good game to have achievements in. I, I do... Um, they did put in a leaderboard, which is a good idea for this type of game, but it would also be nice if they put in achievements. Also, I know there's a multiplier at the top, right? But I don't see anything that tells me what my score is, so... I don't know why it matters with the multiplier. Seems to be a large number of berserkers heading your way. Okay. Still don't know where the front entrance is either. I thought this would be it, because it has a gate, but I don't know. Maybe it's up here, actually. Are these berserkers? They're pretty fast. Uh-oh. Hiya! Boom. Or does the multiplier just mean more damage? Maybe that's what the multiplier is for. It resets whenever you get hit, as normal for a multiplier. I like that he doesn't have any melee attack, so he's kind of like just doomed until that green circle comes down. Green circle hits after he's dead, though. Heroes are coming in mass. That mean are the only heroes those the main connector. Where's that at, dude? I have no idea where anything is in this game. Oh, whatever. Get back. Ha ha. Where is the main connector? It keeps talking about these powerful buffs that I cannot find. I wish there was like a map or something that would tell me what a main connector is and I'm stuck, I'm dying. Would it be up here? Is there a main connector up here? Yes! Whoa. Ah, this is what it does. It's like insta-kill. I'd like lightning powers with this, please. I am untouchable! The final wave is here. Alright, yeah, there's ten waves of thing. Hmm. I'm gonna start rating games, too. I'm gonna start giving them, like, a rating of what I think they are at the end of the game. I feel like that'd be fun. Might as well talk about how my rating system will work. So, five, if it's a... I'm gonna rate based off price. Um... Price, how good the game is, how much I'd... It's basically just gonna be if I would play the game if I was you, pretty much. But, um... Even if a game's free, though, I'm not gonna just recommend it because it's free, because I hate when people do that. Or if it's, like, cheap. Like, it doesn't matter if it's free or cheap, but the game sucks, bro. It still costs time to play it. This is not a bad game. I'm not saying that because it's a bad game, I'm just letting people know. They're like, oh, why are you rating free-to-play games so harshly? Because it sucks. <laughs> God dang it. That's why. But, um, yeah. But six is, five will be average, of course. It's going to be a ten-point scale. Five will be average. Anything above five is above average. And... 
So if it's like a six or something, that means it's a little bit above average for a free to play game. And then one basically means the game didn't work. Game's garbage does not work. Or is it, ah, uh, we'll say one because it's one to 10. It's not zero to 10. So yeah, I'm getting pretty good at this though. So I'm used to it now. Heroes aren't kidding around at their last defeat. There's one good thing they also did about this game is that um, the waves don't, there's like no timer in between the waves. You don't have to wait a certain amount of time. It's whenever you kill the heroes or the enemies, like the wave starts immediately after, which is really nice. They don't make you wait for another wave. Oh, I got ice powers now. Ice is awesome, boy. I like ice. Jesus. And you get new powers as you go through your... Oh, I did say you can unlock new spells by doing the campaign. That's pretty sick. I like that a lot, actually. That adds... Even though the ice is broken, it's still really cool. Yeah, I don't know if I'll play all the way to the point I can get to in the Endless. I might kill myself just because it might take us a long time if I play this on Endless mode. I don't think it'll ever get too hard where I can't live unless there's no items at all. Because you can tell I make mistakes, but if there's items, then I'll just live forever. That's a super archer. Oh, that's a new hero, I guess. I want, uh, ice powers. Okay, maybe. That archer hero is pretty rough, actually. He's still alive. Huh, I'm talking about not dying and I'm barely struggling to survive right now. Oh, they got me like corner boy. There we go. Let's get him ice powers. Archer hero is tough, boy. Finally, Jesus. Dude had health. Or I was missing. I could have swore I hit him a lot though. Huh, huh. That was interesting. I guess it does have some difficulty to it. Nice. Good job, creators. Boom. Boom. I'm just gonna keep hitting him. I wanna see how long it takes him to die. I'm not even gonna dodge. I'm just gonna hit him. He's not dying, dude. He's so tanky. God dang. Okay. Well, that's good to know. Okay, there's another archer. Oh, I gotta get out of here. Oh, wow. Hmm. Well, I talked about not dying, and they showed me. But again, I was trying to see how tanky that archer was. He's obviously way more tanky than I thought. I wonder how long they stay spawned for. He could have already left by now, and I would have no idea. Oh, hell. Dude, there's a whole... Oh, wow, I didn't know that was a thing. Well, damn. Obviously, I'm gonna skip to the freaking point I died at, but damn. See outside the map, you bastard. Might have to include that in my video just because, just show the creator that people can get stuck outside the map, which is not good. Ah, uh, fuckers. Pretty much useless against the Archer, dude, unless they're coming around the corner. God, he's so tanky, dude. And he hit me. Oh, you freaking punk. I had like a four times multiplier. Oh, you bastard. 
Beast. What's he doing? I can hit him, kinda. Yay. All right, we're back to where we died. There's something I noticed. I'm going to try to include in my video, but some of the enemies can get stuck on things, and some of them can even get stuck outside the map. I was able to hit them outside the map, so it didn't, like, ruin the run or anything, but it's just something for maybe the creator to work on because that kind of sucks, having to play hide-and-seek with the enemy, especially when they're outside the map. That does not feel too great. When the one that was stuck inside the map wasn't too big a problem because I could just find him pretty quick. But the one that was outside the map, I was actually looking for him for a bit. I'm so stuck. Uh, I lost my multiplier because I got stuck. And I didn't want to fall in the lava, so... Arcane champions are my favorite. The Ranger champions actually add a good bit of difficulty to this game. Because lightning power is almost useless against them unless you're like hugging a corner or something. And you're like bouncing attacks off people. And you gotta be hiding in the corner they can't shoot through. Because if they can shoot through, you're still done, son. Um, so fire is the best one against them. Ice is I. It's got pretty much the same problem as fire, though. It's really hard to get close enough to hit them with the ice without taking damage. And fire seems to do the most damage anyway, so... Archers definitely try to teach you how to use the fire skill if you're trying to cheese your way out of not using it, because it's hard. Really hard to get your guy pointed the right way with the fire. It's really nice though when they drop so much health like this. That's really nice. I dig that. Look how tanky this dude is. I guess lightning just probably does the least damage. Yeah, probably. Safe bet. This is going to hurt. I don't think so. No, I don't think so. It's not going to hurt me. I don't know who... I don't know who's supposed to hurt, but it ain't going to hurt me, son. I'm too fast. Too furious. Oh, there's more archer people. Be nice if the ice had kind of like a dot as they ran through it, but it'd probably be really broken if it did, because it sits on the map for a pretty decent amount of time. Yeah, this is a good place for the lightning power. If you have somebody chasing you like this, eventually you should be able to hit them with it without taking damage. Oh, I went ice, lightning ice. Did I don't know if I have a set form that I have to change into. I don't know how the forms work. I think it just auto does it. I don't think you can influence it at all. But I don't think it goes in like a set pattern either. Oh, they're stuck. That green guy's stuck. Not stuck enough though. God, I can't get the hit on him. Okay, I'm good, actually. They do spawn in from certain points though, so you can like know where they're gonna come from usually, I think. Like that bridge point to the left up here, they spawn there. Right here. Why'd you pick that up, son? Go pick that up. I'm gonna go around the river bend, go pick that up. You'll never catch me until I want you to. Alright, health pot, health pot. Oh! Yay, I finally got fire form, the best form. For these guys, anyways, for sure. 
Ah! Ah! I can't tell where they're shooting from. Okay, one down. Can't fall off the map. Well, you probably saw me fall off the map, so I don't really need to say that, I don't think. You can fall off the map, though. You didn't see me do it. Excuse me. Do they ever get tired of this? I don't know, man. <laughs> Can't wait to see what the final power is. Oh, I know where the cell block is, I think. I think. I'm not sure. No, I'm not going this way. I don't like the lava that much. I don't like that room, actually. I'll take that damage to get out of the lava. What if I did this? <laughs> it doesn't attack frequently enough to be a viable strategy, I don't think. Wah. Is this not the cell place? There it is. I'll take that, thank you. Well, that was easy. I like that. <laughs> that went really well. I wonder who's on the leaderboards right now. I'm gonna try to get first place in my run, and then I'll probably quit. Instead of just like surviving forever. Seems like a good idea. Who's that? Is that a healer? What are you doing here, good little guy? That's a bad move on your part. Oh, dude's in the wrong dungeon, I think. I'm stuck. Oh, I'm stuck. I would like firewalls. Sick. Huh. Well, he's kind of weak. I don't know what he does, even. I saw his yellow barrier, but I don't know what that does, bro. I don't even know if it did anything for you. Yeah, I am excited to see what the third power is, though. I'm quite excited. It's gotta be like a dark form or something, I think. I got fire, ice, and lightning. Give me dark or something. Let's see. The castle! Click to start. My final bastion. Clear the pest from it as well. Alright. Ow. My final bastion. I had the game bastion. I never beat it. That was a that was a high game. I don't remember too much about it. It's like a top-down dungeon crawler thing too, I think. Oh, we got fireball. What's after fireball? Give me a different power. Nice. Champion this early. Something is off. Didn't we get champions early last time? I thought. Maybe not. I don't know. Who's the champion? What do you mean something's off? They're trying to kill you, bro. It's not like they're doing it, like, fair. Okay, I have not seen my new power yet. Would like new power, please. I guess you could just circle around the archer with the ice power. That's probably how you're supposed to do it. Like this. Okay. You just circled the archer guy. Okay. That's how you use other powers that aren't fire. But you gotta keep circling or you're gonna take damage, obviously. As demonstrated. Oh, here we go. Wind power. I didn't want wind power. I wanted the dark power. God dang it, I'm evil. Where's the chaos power? I mean, this is kind of easy to hit, but I don't know. I don't know how much I like it. This doesn't seem to do a whole lot of damage. It seems kind of weak. Fire is the best, I guess. Uh, let's go find the chest room, I guess. Aim. Whack. Like I said, it would be really nice if they put some kind of like indicator or sign what room's what. I know there's like items that are supposed to replicate it, but it's still kind of hard to tell them apart. They look very similar to me. Like that over there is a chest, really. You really think about it. That is a chest. Where's my power up? <laughs> I 
Oh, there it is. This is the chest room? I guess there's two chests in here. That makes it the chest room. More than one chest. Arcane energy is shifting. Something is wrong. You sure, bro? Feels like we're doing pretty well. Honestly. You telling me the good guys have something up their sleeve? I don't believe it. We better have something up our sleeves. We're the bad guys. The bad guys always have something up their sleeve. And then we lose after we use our trump card. That's how this works. Yeah, this one's by far the easiest to hit, but it's just so not that good. I could run away and hit him with it, to be honest with you, which is kind of neat. But, I mean, it doesn't, it's all right, I guess. Fire form's the best. It might be better if you want to do a leaderboard, if you just kept fire and lightning and just shift between those two instead of unlocking the other ones. If you really care about your leaderboard, just so you can get to fire sooner, because fire does the most damage. Which makes this a lot faster. Not die. Die, please. Thank you. Get ready for a large assault. I've been ready, dude. I've been ready since I started playing this game. Large assault me. Oh! Give me a big assault. Oh, uh, you can't get me. I'll be quicker than that, fool. Can't wait till I get my... Oh, that's not fireball. That's ice. Dang it. Oh, this is nice. I like the... Let's just explore. I like the scenery. I don't like that there's levels of stages, which makes it where your stuff misses sometimes because you're on a different level. Something new is approaching. Be careful. Oh, I can jump down. That's kind of cool. Oh, him? The super berserker? What's he gonna do? Chest room. I know where that's at. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. Is it that? That dude's not new. I've seen him. So where's the new thing at? Oh, there's multiples of them. Still not new, though. Believe it or not. Where's the new thing at? Is he stuck on something? He's stuck on something, new thing? He's on the stone? No. I don't know where he's at. Hey, bro, where you at? Stop hiding. This isn't cool, dog. Making me look for you. Well, here's the spawning point, probably. I don't know. I want to know where you're at. No idea, bro. Ah. Hmm. Goodness gracious. Oh, so, yeah, there he is. You're hiding outside the map. This is what I'm talking about. They do that. Which, I mean, they don't really attack, but it makes it really hard to kill them. And really hard to find them. That was not new. A healer killed him quickly. That was a healer, wasn't it? What's the new thing? I didn't see any new thing. Is that what those are? Healers? Or is there another thing that is a healer? They don't heal a lot if they do heal. Just putting that out there. They do not heal a whole bunch. Uh oh, they're overlapping. They're healing each other. They ain't healing each other enough, apparently, and they don't attack, so. 
That dude's stuck. So, interesting. Yeah, you're gonna die the slow way, my dude. Sorry. Shouldn't have got down there. I don't even know how you got down there. Mistake. Their numbers are growing. Are they, though? Headshot. Hmm, there's so many health potions. Hi, <laughs> dude. Nice. Their forces are starting to run out. It's the final assault. No, that's a wave nine. There's ten waves, bro. Not the final assault. You lied. Powerful buff has wherever that is. The armory. I'm sure that's gonna be easy to find. This armory. Nope. Nope. Where's the armory at, my dude? This armory? Looks more like a throne room, but who knows? Well, this is the chest room for sure. 100% the chest room. This is, oh, this is the armory. Okay. But now you're all doomed, I guess. Yay! Now their final attempt. Crush their final attempt. Alright. Shouldn't be too hard, I don't believe. Well, well, well. If it isn't the final attempt, they're doing the best they can, I guess, which isn't very good. Okay, wind's pretty good, actually. I kind of dig wind, but fire's, I still think, the best. Once you get used to fire, fire's probably the hardest to hit with, though. By far. Did we win? Is this it? Wow. There should be a final boss, hopefully. Some kind of final boss. The healers don't do anything. The healers suck. You suck. Where's the final boss? Ah, uh, no final boss, dude? That's kind of whack. Alright, let's see how... F uh, let me check something real quick. Hurricane and poison. I didn't get to see do poison. Um, Where's the leaderboard? Ah, oh, the leaderboard's just online. Ah, oh, me! I'm the best! Nobody's played it. I'm going to be the best. Hooray! Uh, which map do we want? I like the castle the best. Oh, hell, I didn't... Wait, go back. I want fire, or poison. So can I uncheck the ones I don't want? Let me try something real quick. Campaign, castle... God, I'm an idiot. Oh, I'm an idiot. Stop it. Stop being dumb, me. Endless. Alright, let's try that one. What if you get all of them? Oh, you can unlock... Oh, maybe the modifiers aren't in the game yet. Or maybe you unlock them, I'm not sure. Oh, poison's pretty freaking cool. Look at that. Huh. Alright, who wants some? Do they run into it and die? Yeah, that's broken. That's stupid broken. I could just throw poison in front of me and run into it and they're gonna die. I am on... Oh, now you get a score. Okay. That's what the multiplier's for. I thought it was for damage, but it might not be. Hmm. Yeah, you could just do poison and run around the map to your heart's content and win. That's pretty dumb, actually. <laughs> I don't know, wind might be better though, because you pretty much do the same thing, but it might do more damage. Because anything that's chasing you is going to get hit by wind because it shoots directly behind you, so. Uh, 
Well, I guess I got the high score. Did I keep playing? I don't know. I guess I could see if the leaderboard actually works. That'd probably be good to do. I don't think I'm gonna play this too long. Uh, so I'll give this game a seven, oh, six, probably a six. It's above average, but it's really redundant. There's no ending boss fight. There's not much story in it either. Um, it plays pretty well, but it's really simplistic. There's only t really two keys: your mouse and then aiming with your left click and left click, left click on and left click off, kind of thing. Uh, I did like the powers, which is pretty much what makes it above average, that you can unlock things. I like that a lot when creators do that. When you can unlock things without paying money, or you just play the game, and the better you do, the more things you unlock. I think that's really nice. Um, also, another thing that makes it a 6 out of 10 is that it has an endless mode if you want to compete with people. Nobody playing it yet, but that could be cool. Give us some replay value. Um, but yeah, the campaign's pretty long, and there's not much difference in it. It's not... Um, super challenging. I did have one. I did die twice on the second stage, though. But that was more just me being dumb and not it being challenging. Um, I could do endless mode forever without dying. There's not enough in it to kill me. Uh, let's see. Is there anything else? Yeah, it's a really neat concept. It's just kind of redundant, though. And there's not enough here to make it. Like, the story's not interesting enough to keep me. Interested without with the simplistic gameplay the graphics are nice. I think I like the stages, but I wish there was more actually telling you what Which room is what? Because it's like oh you can find this in the armory room Which one's that I guess there are this one's not too bad because there are like signifying things like this has Weapons so obviously the armory, but see this one only has two chests. This one has a chest too, so I I guess it's because it's the throne room, but that could be confusing. The second map's the one where it's really hard to tell which room's which, I think. Like the prison room, I don't know the difference between that and other rooms. Or the storage room. Or the front, like the front entrance in the first stage, I don't know where that's at still. But yeah, thanks for watching as always guys, that'll probably be the end of the video for me. I, it, it's pretty fun, it's just redundant a bit. Alright guys, bye!